hey guys welcome back to the innovative how to videos i was guys just uh, uh, going to the some you know phone reviews of the stc 10 and this uh, uh, lg g5 and these phones so i, I saw a cool feature in lg g5 uh, they have the always on display so i was just comparing this uh, you know whether we can get uh, these features to any of the phones and how much they are good or not so somewhere it is common to you know uh, there is a technology called glance screen as you can see right uh, this is what uh, is there it shows us time and whatever information notification you want it shows the date and can, many stuff it shows so it was used by nokia and it's copyrighted to nokia stuffs and it's available to mostly many of the windows phones but uh, somehow uh, these things uh, came to android in the terms of the name it is called as a you know uh, ambient display for example the nexus phones if i just uh, put here and uh, these phones have so this phone basically need uh, this you know uh, amoled panel so sometimes it does work i mean Sometimes it doesn't work. So it's called uh, ambient display in the phone. And let me show you guys inside the setting here. So if in case you have any phone and which does support this uh, ambient display, so turning that on. So also it is called as a motor display because uh, Motorola phones uh, doesn't need an AMOLED panel, but the Motorola phones does have these things. And if you just go to the, for example, display, as you can see, this is an ambient display. Uh, when screen uh, wake screen when you pick up device or receive so it works on your sensors when you keep your phone out of the pocket so it shows you times and notification at all but somehow uh, that is just limited when you try to wake up your phone and all so this is not a complete feature you will not get many of the most features like you should get on your uh, things like so there's a good app i want to show you guys today i just found that today maybe you can see here guys i just lifted my phone and i got a couple of the uh, notifications here you can see the temperature and uh, the current temperature shows service index and shows times battery percentage time and optionally shows uh, apps notification that you want and these are the notification from my app if i just double tap here we'll get the notifications you can see these are the notifications that i have here so this uh, app shows me notification of two things uh, first is for my this uh, uh, studio creator uh, studio app and this one that's all we saw there if i just put my phone there and see this is called the similar to the glance screen feature and uh, the app name is called glance plus as you can see we are getting the similar notification so let me show you guys and uh, there are few important points uh, before i show you guys and uh, you just uh, keep that in mind so the app name is called uh, this uh, glance plus so i downloaded a couple of apps but this one is the most rated and they have a uh, lot of features so this app is free app but it has a lot of in-app purchases and it goes to uh, less than a dollar to fifty dollar depends on what feature you want so i've not bought because uh, my ambient display works for me pretty much well and i need just time stamp notification that's why uh, i just want to show you guys here so if you open that app uh, and even in the promo video you can see uh, this is a nokia phone and nokia lumia 1520 and they just shows the glance feature that how they uh, move this feature to here and it's quite number of download, 100,000 is not less. And some important points, guys. Uh, uh, it is recommended to use on phone uh, which has this, you know, uh, AMOLED panel. Because uh, as you can see, if you just turn that on here, off. And if you just put your phone here. So this thing actually takes battery, a lot of battery. If your phone is not AMOLED, because AMOLED panel, black doesn't take battery just white things need to be illuminated that's why amoled panels i prefer amoled panel they give a lot of batteries so that's why it's needed so you can try that it's not going to take much battery just assume two percentage of battery in a day so if you are looking for such kind of feature uh, it's nice you can definitely go and take this kind of feature and and uh, yes uh, it uh, to get all the features uh, you need to uh, buy that app and you can double tape uh, to wake up and go so let's let me open that app called glance plus here so you need to turn on the glance plus and you have the options so it's similar to always on display if you buy that feature you need to buy that feature a glance type if you go and always on you need to buy that and you can see always on feature may consume much battery only recommended amoled screen so uh, you need to buy that app and then you can get all these features but then with my ambient display works so i don't need to buy so and going back again they are lot of options you can uh, glance uh, auto start on boot uh, after screen lock auto rotate and how much you, uh, brightness and dimness you want the text white text how much you want content brightness so that's just going to affect battery slightly not more so i've been using this from yesterday itself and night so i will show you guys how much battery does it takes 
actually I just enabled that in the morning but I installed that on yesterday night and you can uh, display weather uh, battery uh, you want the weather information that, for example I have shown you guys here battery notification calendar you can also include and you can change the clock type let me change the clock type here if I go to clock here and change this uh, gear Samsung gear s2 and just lock it there and just put my phone you can see I got this beautiful Samsung gear s2 lock screen right clock so you can configure it in many ways so depends on what feature you want guys you can buy that app and good thing is that uh, you need to use a power button it's just double tape to disable so that's also very good stuff if you don't want to use the power button you can just double tap here and open that and let me show you guys some of those features so go back here and yeah, going back here. so yeah calendar you can also display if you want to display calendar you can use a calendar notification which notification you want I show notification miss call sms glance on notification already showing me so this uh, notification reminder is a paid person you need to buy that interval you can buy that so a sensor events wake or proximity pick up from table as i shown you guys here i just picked up my phone it shows me glance notification so uh, inactive hours you can say if you want to save battery you can turn on the time and what time to what time for example night 11 to morning 8 it's not going to work so you can disable in that way auto rotate and pocket we are already enabled so time period to display you can configure how, how long you want so many features guys so just thought to show you guys a good glance screen here so i'm just going to disable that again here i'm just going to put that on table so it should come you can see super so just I told you guys if you have amulet panel you should use that otherwise uh, it may consume a sort of batteries but is this the phone uh, running uh, android marshmallow and i've shown you guys this glance plus app and i've shown you guys nexus 6p nexus 6 both for amulet display so i was just testing that on ips lcd panels as you can see here and this is glance screen app is perfectly working uh, i just just tested the battery it's not taking much uh, to here uh, just uh, you know as you can see we just uh, double tap here it's unlocking here um, let me show you guys the battery static so it's uh, around two hours i'm running that so maybe uh, we can i'm heavily using this always turned on most of the times here so just go here and just taking 12 5 mb space here as you can see here 19 mb of memory in the last three hours and just zero percent of battery so it's not that huge as we expected so uh, if you just lock the phone double tap to lock here if you just take here you can see it just turned on after just turning Hovering your phone because detecting the proximity sensor it detects. In case you have phones with IP L C D panels, so it's no need to worry about I guess. It's not going to take much battery, even if it takes, it takes hardly max of one two percent of battery. So that much sacrifice we can make that, obviously. Let me show you how much battery does this app take. I will buy this app, uh, sure. A couple of the features not much because I like this double tap to wake phone. I don't need this uh, you know this phone doesn't have fingerprint sensor as does have an Nexus 6P. And just show you guys the battery, how much battery it takes because this is glance plus it takes 20 mb installation and moving ahead so you can see guys since my phone is amulet so it doesn't take much battery because just need to emulate white text it doesn't take but uh, i'm sure in in case your phone doesn't have amulet panel so anyway it's fine uh, this is a good way so that's how guys you can achieve the always on display on your android phones whenever you want and glance screen feature from the windows phone that you have so these kinds of features hope you enjoyed that app and you can buy according to whatever you want in the sort of band the scene and thank you very much for watching guys do hit the thumbs up and subscribe button to like more talk to you very soon have a nice day ahead